Yes, yes. The Lord is good. The Lord is great. <laughs> God is great. Oh, God. That's, that's, that's God's blessings right here. This speaker. It's God's blessings. Don't forget God's blessings. I'm going to keep a low key right now. And try not to be too hype. Not to draw too much, too much attention to myself. Police officers. <laughs> and want to shut people, preachers down. Oh, Lord. Praise him, praise him, praise the Lord. The creator of the universe. The one who fashioned the cosmos. The one who fashioned, the one who gave you life is God. Don't, don't forget the God who gave you life. And don't forget the God who gave you your life. Oh, if our God is no life, if our God, we got no life. No true life apart from God. You got no abundant life apart from God. Oh, God gives the powerful life. Oh, God gives the transformed life. Why do they reject God? Why do, why do the heathens reject God? Because they want to remain in the uh, that's pool of sin. But the Bible says you got it. You gotta sin no more, lest the worst thing come upon you. Oh, don't sin. God give you power for the journey. If you sin, if you fall short of God's glory. He can. Oh, God can raise you up again. He said, "Right this, the right this man will fall." Seven times. Oh, but the Lord will raise him up again. He'll, no, he will. He'll come up again. Seven times again. Better, stronger than before. The righteous fall, fall, but he will rise again. Oh, I want to see you rise again. I want to see you rise again to better, to greater. I want to see you rise again. Better than you were. Better. Better than last year. Better than before. Time to get better. It's time to get better. Time to grow. Time to take put God first place in your life. Oh, it's time to put God first place. Oh no, not last place. God's calling you to first place. First place belongs to God and God alone. Yeah, God gets, God gets my, God gets my time, and God gets, and God, and God gets my attention. Amen. God gets my attention every day. He gets it. God every day gets my attention. God gets my attention. God gets it. But he made he made my attention. Oh God made my attention. Oh yes. Don't forget God. Oh don't forget God. He's calling. He's calling. Everyone. Everyone. He's gone everyone, everywhere. To come, to turn, to turn. To turn, to turn, to turn, to turn to God. Oh, it's time to turn to God. It's time to turn to the living God. Oh yeah, he's the God that made life. He's the God that made your, your, your body parts. Oh, without God, you got no life. Oh no. Oh, without God, there's no life. Without God, there's no life. 
If our God, He don't live. If our God, He don't breathe. Praise Him, praise Him. Oh, there's nothing apart from God. Nothing. Things not working properly. Probably got to change this up. To my other speaker. Oh, today's a day of salvation. Today's a day that we turn to living God. Bless me, bless me, bless me. He messed up. Messed up. Messed up. Messed up. illicit behaviors they're bound in with addictions but God said today a new mind created in Christ Jesus righteousness righteousness man 
I want a new mind. I want. I want. I want think differently. What the Bible says: Let, let this mind be in you, which was in Christ Jesus. Let it. You gotta let it happen. It won't. Ha it won't happen by itself. It won't happen automatically. You have to let this mind be in you. You, you need a holy mind. You need a pure mind. You, you got a pure mind yet? You got a holy mind yet? You, you got to learn from Jesus Christ. Ain't no one had a better mind than Jesus. Ain't nobody had a cleaner mind than Jesus. Jesus had the best mind ever. The cleanest mind. Jesus' mind wasn't in the gutter. Jesus' mind was always so uplifted. <laughs> Jesus' mind always so clean, pure. If we thought better, we would live better. Come on. God wants you to think new thoughts. He says, Casting that down every imagination and the thought was anything that highly exhausts itself against God, cast it down. Uh oh. The negative thoughts of anger, cast it down. The violent thoughts, cast it down. The low self esteem thoughts, cast it down. Fearful thoughts, cast it down. Insecure thoughts, cast it down. I want you to think better. Think clearly. And when God gets a hold of you, you don't think the same anymore. I say when God gets a hold of you, you don't live the same anymore. Come on. God wants to set you on the right path to success. It starts by surrendering to Him first, submitting your all to Him. You playing games with God. God don't play games with you. God don't play games. God is serious. Amen. Their thoughts are not on God. What are your thoughts on? What are your thoughts on? Not God. Oh, your thoughts are on yourself. Your thoughts are on yourself. Having a good time. Your thoughts are just selfish. Is God in your thoughts today? Is God in your thoughts today? I, I think about God every second. I'm in love with God. Oh yeah. I'm 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 in love with God. Yeah. Me and God, we, we go we go way back. <laughs> Me and God go way back. Amen. You think you know what love is? No, you don't know, you don't know what love is. Apart from God. No. They don't know what love is. Away from God. Ah, but they know what lust is. Oh, they know what lust is. You want a real love man? You want husbands? Husbands, you want to love your wife? Invite God in. Husbands, love your wife. Wife loves your husbands. You want to really love your, your parents? Love people? You got to know God. You can't, you can't love without knowing God. Truly love. <laughs> If you think you know God, if you think you know God, when you hate your brothers and sisters or, or people around you, you don't know God. No, if you, if you love pe if you love God, you will love people. I said if you love God, you will love people. But some of you don't know how to love when somebody irks you the wrong way. When they annoy you, talk against you, how do you respond? How do you respond when people uh, violate you? Uh-oh. <laughs> when they violate you, how do you respond? 
your response should indicate just how much you have got or not whether you have got or not oh man you know when people violate me i say god oh i love you i know you don't understand what you're doing but i love you anyway you don't understand that's why you act the way you do because sinners will act like sinners and saints will be saints saints will be saints sinners will be sinners so i'm not surprised no when they hate on me god said love on them god said when they hate you love them love your ex-husband love your ex-wife don't don't scorn them L love those enemies don't 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 be a hater don't be a hater oh man i'm trying to save you man i'm trying to guide you you want real love you gotta you gotta embrace god man some of you man some of you once the, once the man loses money you leave him that's not love oh once once the man once my man gets broke you got no money no job i'm gonna leave him you don't have love then what if you lose your beauty one day you will what if you get saggy wrinkly your man your man leaves you he gonna leave you i don't care how thick you are i don't care how firm you are firm body parts it's all gonna sag it's all gonna sag i look past the beauty nice guys they're so trapped with the beauty obsessed with beauty obsessed with booty yeah they're, they're obsessed with breasts oh but god god wants you to see past it man <laughs> god wants you to see past the body parts man can you see the person's heart perceive god will give you the sermon god will give you the sermon it's, so, it's my brother's brother. let me just let him with everybody oh oh Where? What's your name? I'm Denon. I'm Denon. Denon? Denon, yeah. Yo, everybody, what's good? What's good? Yo, listen, this is my brother Nate's birthday, man. Woo! On the count of three, we gonna wish him a happy birthday, man. One, two, three! Happy yeah. birthday! Yo, I appreciate the love, man. Yo, Nate, you got anything to say, bro? Nah, nah. <laughs> All right, man, we out, man. Y'all be safe. All right. If you smoke cigarettes, put it away. We out. A amen. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah, that's God that's God speaking to him. He said, put them cigarettes away. You don't want lung cancer. <laughs> you don't want lung cancer. You don't want to cough up a lung. No, I care about you. You're not you're not you're not a chimney. You're a chimney? You're a car exhaust? No. You're a human being. Human. Being, oxygen, O2, more plants. That's you need, more plants. More vegetation, fresh air, air to breathe. You don't need carcinogens to cough. <laughs> oh man, you drop down dead because you refuse to give up the chain smoking. <laughs> ice cold water water ice that guy's funny though i like that guy <laughs> today 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 ice cold water <laughs> amen today if you hear his voice Harden not your heart. Harden not your heart. Today, man. Today is great. You enjoy. Look, man, look, man, look at God's sunlight. Look at that beautiful sunlight. Look, look at God's goodness. Most of you don't give God thanks. The, the air you breathe every second. Every second. Oh, that precious air. Wow. And you say God isn't loving. 
You say God don't care about nobody. God gave you precious air. Air to breathe. Come on. Man, look at that beautiful water, man. Popping up. That's God's blessings. That water. The fountain. You know what Jesus said? I want to give I, I want to give you everlasting life like that that's springing up Jesus compared to like a fountain of water everlasting life springing up water springing up into everlasting life the water amen look at that, look, 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 look at that beautiful cascade Oh, how it goes up and comes down. Ooh, ooh, beautiful, beautiful. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. We don't give God thanks, man. But today, man, I want to give God a chance to reign in me, man. I want to get God a chance to be glorified and the devil's, the devil's horrified, man. Ah. Why do we today we get reject God? Why do we reject God? Why do we reject God? Is it because we don't want to change? No. They say, preacher, why are you preaching? No, I'm not only preaching, I'm teaching. I'm teaching a lesson. Uh-oh. Class is in session. I'm teaching a lesson. You don't want to fail. A, great A. Who is the best teacher? Jesus is the best teacher. No, not Miss Tyler. Not Mr. Michaels. Not Miss uh, Susie. <laughs> no, not your elementary school teacher, middle school teacher. High school teacher, Jesus is the best teacher ever, ever. That's why I, 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 I love his class. Read his textbook. Read Jesus' textbook. The Bible, man. What you reading every day? Horoscopes? New Age philosophies? A lot of you still depressed? You, you still watching pornography? You still, you still, you still cheating? Yeah, it's true. They did the, the, the porn. They gotta get freedom from that. They don't know Jesus yet, man. That's a problem. Oh man, Christ will set you free. You're watching Harry Potter movies, you know, reading romantic novels, romantic, romantic. You know, the people read romantic novels. A lot of them got divorced four times. How you how you read romantic novels and you got divorced multiple times? You still got divorced. Uh oh, romantic novels. And your and your and your wife is still saying you're not you're not loving her. Right. Uh oh, your man telling you you're not romancing him good. Some of you have romantic novels all over, but you still have all these relationship problems. You want to know how to love somebody real? Learn Jesus. R read the book of John. You, you want romance? Read the, the Song of Solomon. That's a romantic book right there. That's a romantic book right there, the Song of Solomon. <laughs> yeah, man, we know. Once you love Jesus, husbands will go back to their wife. Once they love Jesus, wives will go back to their husbands. Oh, God didn't call you to be a to be a, a tramp. Don't be a slut. Don't be a whore. No, God didn't call you to do that. God called you a queen. To be a queen. Are you a queen? Are you a queen? Oh, don't 
Don't curse out that man. Some of you ladies, you keep cursing out that man. Why are you cursing him out? Oh no, man wants to be respected. Respect that man, ladies. Oh, he will run. He will run to another woman, ladies. Come on, ladies. God, God call you together. Holy. The marriage bed. Undefiled. That's that's the that's that's the bed God wants you in. The marriage bed. Not a stripper's bed. Oh, don't go to don't go to that whore's bed. No, go to your wife's bed. Your husband's bed. Oh man. Some of you got no self-control. What is self-control that? Your bodies, man. Your bodies are out of control. Carving your bodies, marking your bodies, abusing your bodies. You should love yourself. You, you know? Come on. And who, 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 who made your body? God made your body, man. God, God, you know, God made your body. So if God made your body, I can't just praise anybody. I got I, I gotta praise the God who made the body. God made the body. Don't forget God. Don't forget God. <laughs> oh, don't forget don't don't don't. Don't forget God. He made He made the body. Don't forget God. He made the body. Amen. God is God. God, God deserves it, man. God deserves the word, the, 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 the honor, the honor. Oh, so how come they can put to play loud music? Huh? Aren't they playing loud music? Anybody here playing loud music? So that's not amplified? No, no sound reviews are amplified. Huh? No sound reviews are amplified, okay? No, oh, so, so, so. You can't have this song, okay? Oh, because, because it's amplified? So that's not amplified? Not. So, so what's, what, 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 do mean, what do you mean by amplified? Uh, so what do you mean? What do you mean by amplified? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by amplified? Isn't that, is it, um, amplified mean like loud, amplified like? Basically from here, from the device. Okay. Sound replicators and device. Okay. What, what about like instruments, like like? Instruments, you can, yeah. Oh, okay, but not, but not speakers. Not speakers. Okay. Okay. All right. So, what, 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 what about the guy that's playing music over there with, with a JBL well, speaker? I'm, I'm addressing you. Okay? Oh, okay. Can I be having this? Oh, okay, all right. All right. Next time, it'll be confiscated. Okay. I don't want to confiscate you. Okay, can, right. I, can, I, can I turn it down? Or? No, no, can I turn it down? Oh, okay. It has to be completely low. Okay. What, what, what about like, like a small mic, a small speaker? No, no. No? No? Right. Okay, okay. Okay. Um, one last question. Like, what, what is the reasoning for that about why you can't play? Is, 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 is complaints it, and uh, no. Complaints? Yes. Oh, so, 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 if you have a sound permit, no problem. Okay, if you don't okay. have a sound permit, then you cannot be clear. Okay. okay. All right. Got you. All right. Have God bless you. Amen. God bless you. I don't Thank you want so to confiscate this stuff. Okay. I'll use my voice. Okay. Amen. All right. God bless you. Thank, Thank you so much. The Lord's calling everyone everywhere to repent. Then today, if you hear his voice, harden not your heart. Amen. We got these foolish rules here, but hey, I gotta, I'll follow it while, I, while I'm here. Once I leave, I'll, I'll do what I got to do. Anyway, God's calling you to repent. Say today, if you hear my voice, harden not your heart. A lot of you are ignoring God. And one day you're going to take your last breath and you're going to die. But God's calling you to say today, my child, if you hear my voice, harden not your hearts. Amen. Man's rules is very foolish. Very foolish. It, it's sad. All the, all the crime happening in the world, all the violence happening in the world. You would think the police would be on, on, on the preacher's side. But no, they don't see the bigger picture. Because even they themselves are in, are in their sin. Even a lot, of, a lot of them are still in their sin as well. But it's the way the world is. The Bible says, today my son, today my daughter, if you hear his voice,
harden not your heart. God didn't call you to be a chimney and smoke it up. God didn't call you a chimney to get drunk as well. God didn't call you to live a life of uh, he said live a life of sobriety. Live a life of sobriety. Amen. I don't want your wife to leave you. I don't want your husband. I don't want your husband to leave you. I don't want your kids to have nothing to do with you. Amen. So it's time to get your life right. It's time to get your temples clean. It's time to get your temples cleansed. Some of you got to go, go to that anonymous meeting. Deal with your alcohol problem. Smoking problem. You got to recognize you have a problem. Drinking problem. Sexual problem. All sorts of family problems. But you ignore the problem. And that's a problem. <laughs> no. Time to solve the problem. Solve it. You need God's help to help you to solve the problems of the world. It's a new heart. You know why so much crime in the world? The, the heart of man is cold. The heart of man is wicked. Because man doesn't know Jesus. That's why there's crime in the world. They don't know God. They ignore God. All they want to watch is their movies, play the video games. All they want is their porno. All they want, all they want is the sports, but they don't want God. Why don't you want your Lord? Why do you reject the Lord? All you do is get entertained all day, you get entertained. And all you see is violence. All you see is revenge. What are you learning? Nothing, nothing. All your Netflix, all your movies, all your video game, most of it teaching you and no time for real education. Pure education. The Bible, man. Oh yeah, the Bible, man. The Bible gives you the best education. Amen. But you neglect the Bible. You believe all the science books, but you don't want to believe the Bible. Amen. Uh, they say, oh no, God's a fairy tale. God don't exist. When you die, you won't exist. When you die, how about that? When you die, you won't exist at all. Uh-oh. Don't forget God. You're limited. Your time here is temporary. White Bible says the passing pleasures of sin. Sin passes by. You, it won't last. It doesn't last. The sexual escapades, the extra matter affairs, your mistress on the side, it won't last. Come on. Time to leave the mistress alone. Time to delete the number of that mistress. Time to delete the number of that, that pimp. Forget them. Delete the numbers. A lot of you bunch of out here, bunch of sex freaks. Oh no. God call you to sin no more. Some of you, you're, you're, you're obsessed with orgasms. Obsessed with orgasms. God's calling you to be obsessed with him. God's calling you to turn to Him. Your partying won't last. The drug dealing won't last. I, I care for your lungs. Oh, the lungs, the smoking. <laughs> no, the smoking cigarettes, your lungs. You don't want a bad liver. You don't want bad kidneys. The drunkenness is killing you. You lost your marriage. A lot of you lost the girl. You lost the man. You got no self-control over your body. 
What are you doing to yourself? What are you doing to Hen the Hennessy? Tequila destroying your liver. Science. Obey science. Science 101. It's all detoxifying. Oh, I mean, intoxicating your body. Toxins, man. Forget toxins, man. Forget things, man, that destroy your body. That destroy your mind. God said, I want to give you a new heart. That's why there's so much evil in the world. We need a new, we don't have a new heart. You're not learning love with your gangster rap music. You're not learning love with your rock and roll. You're not learning love with your reggaeton. You're not learning love by shaking it on the dance floor. Shaking it like a salt shaker. You're not learning love. All you're learning is to be a bigger slut. You're not learning love, man. When God call you to love, he call you to love. What's what? I'm preaching, man. I'm preaching about love. What are you doing? God's calling you to love. Love. Love your enemies. As love. As Christ loved the church and gave himself for you. Amen. We don't want to hear the truth. Of God's word. You can't handle the truth. Oh well. Keep it moving. If you can't handle the truth. Keep it moving. I'm not here for a popularity contest. I'm here to call sinners to repentance. Why you think there's police out here? Because you children keep misbehaving. You children are naughty. Naughty children. Naughty. That's why you got police babysitters out here. You got police babysitting all of y'all. Police babysitting y'all. A lot of you got no self-control. You're violent. You're aggressive. You're quick to run to the gun. You're quick to get vet violent. Oh, but Jesus Christ was so gentle. Jesus Christ was so gentle and loving and peaceful ain't no one better than jesus ain't no one on a rank like jesus man nobody is ain't nobody as loving as jesus he's way up there man you're not better than jesus and loving no see you didn't read about jesus yet Study Jesus. You study George Washington. You study uh, Harriet Tubman. You study Benjamin Franklin. You study uh, uh, Genghis Khan. You study all these other people, but you don't study Jesus? Why? Why do you leave him out? Out of your schools. Why do you leave Jesus out of your schools, teachers? You need to add Jesus to the curriculum. What are we doing? We get mad when evil happens, but then we neglect the one who can teach us how to deal with evil, how to counteract kind of evil. Come on. We forget the one that can teach us how to deal with evil. Amen. The Jesus will teach you how to deal with evil. Jesus will teach you how to how to uh, overcome that depression. Yeah, Jesus Christ, man. Depression. I know not of de I know not of it. Depression. No, cuz I know Jesus. That's why. Anxiety? No. 
know I know not of anxiety, because I know Jesus. Suicidal thoughts? Oh no. I know not of suicide, because I know Jesus. Come on. When you learn Jesus Christ, man, when you get the Holy Spirit in you, man, what happens? You're born again. You're transformed. You're born again by the power of God. Amen. You get power over, over sin. You get power over sin. You got power over sin yet? No, but yes. What, you got you got power over sin, man. But no. God, God will give you power over yes. sin. Yes. Yeah. What's your name? I Mike. I see that guy. Huh? That guy that walked by. Who? Who's that? You didn't see him. What about him? He was, I, I mean, I seen him. Mess, God, oh, God oh. For you, God for you. oh, yeah, yeah. With you. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I get that. I, I get that. I'm, 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 I'm doing this for years. I know how it is. I'm a born again Christian. Amen, amen. It brought tears to my eyes. Oh. If I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That guy brought tears to my eyes. Yeah, God yeah. Bless you. God bless you. If you're doing it without. I am, I am. God bless you. I am, I am. God bless you, man. I, lo I love God you, man. I love you. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> amen, amen. Amen. See, that there's people that, that appreciate the preaching. There's people that appreciate the preaching. That's good. Realizing that we are a fallen world, fallen people. That we need a sour when people reject the gospel. When they don't realize their need for God. They don't realize it. It's sad. But the devil has blinded our, 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 our eyes, our minds. Devil has blinded us to what, what, what what's important, man? What's really important? Come on. What's important, man? What, what do you get when you get God? You get that. When you get God, you get that super joy. When you get God, you get that super peace. Yeah, we get God, you get you get true love, man. Oh yeah, I got love for my haters, man. Love for the haters. My enemies, what do you got? All you got to do, all you do is curse them out. Scorn them. No, God give you power to love your enemies. True Christians love their enemies. Do you love enemies? No, you don't. Real Christians love their enemies. That's the Holy Spirit, man. God's Spirit. Come on. The power of God will give you the power to live holy. Holy. Holiness. Without holiness, none will see God. You want to see God one day? You want to see God one day? You want to see God? You got to be holy. They say, we can't see God. He don't exist. Be holy then, one day you will. Be holy. Uh oh. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Holy. Holiness. Without which none see the Lord. Amen. Holiness. I cry. I cry, man. I get sad when I hear about all the crime in the world. The violence, the shootings, the robbings, the terrorism. Oh, we need the love of the Lord. Oh, we need the love of the Lord. That's what we need. We need more God. We don't need more dancing. We need more repentance. We don't need more partying. We need more repentance. You guys over there partying and dancing. Are you repenting though? Are you repenting though? Some of you know how to dance. Close to Michael Jackson's level. <laughs> close to, at least close. 
Voy a nada.